What's up? Today we're making buffalo sauce. Wait. <gasps> yes, it's me. No hair. Don't care. So let's start off by measuring out some Frank's Red Hot. This is my favorite hot sauce. It's not too spicy, but it is full of spice and I love it. Before we get too deep, go ahead, like, and subscribe to the channel. And I am working on posting more content, so hit that bell button for notifications. When I tell y'all I had the hardest time with this butter, I'm just like, exactly how long is it gonna take me to pop it out? So here's all of our ingredients all scaled out, minus the extra few cups of hot sauce that I'll be putting into that measuring cup once I empty that out. Let's get cooking. So I'm just going to keep vigorously whisking to make sure that there are no clumps with the spices or any other ingredients and just to make sure that everything is mixed thoroughly. Once I see at least one simmer bubble, I will remove it from the heat in order to cool down for packaging. I thought this was the finished bottle and then got reminded that there was no plastic cap on them and I said, oh my God, now I gotta figure this out. This is my first time working with both a heat gun and these little plastic shrink cap. Had to pause for the ASMR moment. As with most things I do in life, I'm just gonna take them out and try it. No YouTube video, no researching, just try stuff. I'm turning to the left, I'm turning to the right. I don't know what difference it makes, but I will when it starts blowing hot. And I was hoping that my glove didn't shrink on me, but I was glad it didn't. I wasn't really feeling too much of an adjustment when I turned it left or right, so it was just continuing to blow kind of lukewarm, coldish air. Oh, man. Whew. 
Yep, I definitely spoke too soon. Well, let's get on with it. So at this point, I'm not really sure what's the best application method with the heat gun. Do I do high? Do I do low? Fast? Do I do slow? I don't know. Is this supposed to be hard and sticking out? Let me know. definitely happy with the result in fact i made me and a couple friends a buffalo chicken sandwich that you can watch me make on tiktok don't forget to puff puff press that like button and see you next time